so i am really interested in football and english class too because english class uh, he always uh, crack jo- sometimes he crack jokes and he teaches us very uh, nicely like uh, all the uh, he ask us the perspectives our views and whatever he is teaching us uh, he ask uh, did you like the class and uh, how was it how can i improve he ask the feedbacks from us he also give real life examples so like from that whenever we go out or we have to speak with someone we have to help uh, someone so therefore we uh, use these things like uh, background knowledge we use there we um, we use our uh, real life uh, opinions examples and we if you want to explain them we can explain so therefore whenever i want to uh, say my perspectives it's my favorite thing because uh, my opinions are really different from others Uh, so it's like a friend whatever problem i have i go to him i tell him he tell me the solution and everything i share with him in class also if i am wrong in something he explains me therefore he uh, stops me at that point and point out my mistakes one day i and my brother was sitting and he started uh, speaking about his teacher like uh, his teacher is really good and he teach very well so i also started speaking about problem bhaiya i told that uh, he always motivates me what do your teacher do and like this our conversation goes on and uh, so therefore we both are, uh, like my brother says i want to come in your school and uh, see robin bhaiya because you always talk with him and says uh, everything about him only english and social science like uh, they are very important for me for me right now and in my future because english like as all of us know english is the language that we use to communicate throughout the world and knowing english is very important in today's world many things are going on in the world so argument writing helps us in making a strong uh, perspective on all the things that are happening as i participate in various competitions like debate competitions or muns so there the pers- putting forward perspective having a strong stand and all these things have helped me a lot my father is like a very violent kind of a person he used to keep on fighting with my mother and uh, uh, used to it uh, beat her and i used to see my mother being worried tensed mm. and uh, like always scared so i i was i got the courage from there and i wanted to wanted it to stop i couldn't i couldn't see that and i explained him so he the, now it has reduced to a large extent i want to become a scientist in isro so my dream college is uwc and i want to go there so that i can improve and uh, become better the one of the best so that i am capable of becoming a scientist work hard i'll get my degree and uh, yeah, just continue studying because there's no end to education i'll try to engage in new things so that i can grow as a person i i can develop so that i become better Robin Bhai's vision is that he wants me to become a good citizen who can put forward his points and uh, his stance stands on anything and put his perspectives his pers- my perspectives and one big challenge that i face is my own laziness Robin Bhai always helps me in he explains me that uh, why it's important and i need to uh, focus and concentrate and work hard and not be lazy some of the values i have learned in Robin Bhai's class are that we should stay focused on one thing and uh, uh, if we are aiming on one thing then it helps we can if if we have one attention focus we can actually we can work better towards achieving it if uh, he tells us to do like uh, stay focused be disciplined and many other things he himself like is an example for of all those things and like so from that we uh, we think that uh, robin bhai does that so we should also do it right now i'm focusing upon my 10th board exams because that is one of like the most important things that i have got to do right now i took part in science olympiad and i came first in the school in the class and i have been selected for the second round which uh, second round and uh, it uh, this thing gives me a confidence that i am not uh, like i'm somewhere close to the people around the world i'm not like very less but i can compete with them when the school started i used to sit in the corner of the class and uh, not used to speak at, uh, speak anything in the school but now when robin bhai has came he has forced all of us and me probably uh, to speak more and now i every time give answers in the class mostly i am able to be confident because the opportunity that i have got in the class uh, 
and go outside also. So he took me to Bombay conference, uh, which I have to speak in front of many people. And he also took me for the city conference, so where I have to speak. And uh, because of speaking, speaking, my all my fear has gone, and I am able to speak confidently in front of everyone. So I have learned critically analyzing, uh, critically analyzing the questions and things whatever I has given us, and uh, I am also able to. If let's say I, I has given me one question, I am able to collaborate and elaborate on it, and uh, I am also able to describe uh, describe more and more like uh, uh, using the ID method. And uh, he has always forced us to describe more and more things, so I am able to do critical analyze and think about it more and more. Uh, at home, we have planned that there will be some time for homework, and others will be for thinking processes, like speaking mostly, writing. And uh, there are some books for maths and logical reasoning, so we saw that because of which our thinking process is also going fast. In the starting of the year, uh, not this year, but uh, two years before, uh, there were many friends of mine. They also never used to smoke with me, and I also didn't. So when when we used to play football, we came very close. So he saw his his friends smoking. He told me, "Chal, uh, to, today we will also smoke." When I told myself that uh, this is not the right way to do do things, so. Uh, at that time, I just called my whole team, the whole team, and told, if you are going to keep on smoking, nothing is going to happen. So, one or one or two players who really wanted to play, I sat with them for a, a longer time and explained them these these things. And I then I, at last I told, it's dependent on you. If you want to live a play football, continue. So you have to uh, you have to leave smoking, or there is no option. They can still they continue, but afterwards they realize that. Uh, their stamina is also going, and then they told, uh, really, my stamina is going, I should have listened to you first, and then they stopped smoking.